overcoming poverty, competing with gangs, and creating strong relationships. It's a tall order. Claudia Solisacala explains how one organization is working to make change in a Fresno neighborhood, starting with the smallest members of the community. The Bigby Villa neighborhood in southwest Fresno has seen a lot of changes. Once a known gang stomping ground, it has been transformed in large part by the Fresno Street Saints. It's a movement of people who together understand that the, that the people in this community have been left behind uh, for decades. They, um, are, they believe in the value of the people that live here. Knowing that the first five years are crucial in the development of a young child, the Fresno Street Saints partnered with First Five Fresno County to survey 150 area families identifying the interest of early childhood education in the community. They followed up with a community-led focus group session. We found that the community um, had really an, didn't have an idea necessarily of what questions they needed to ask about where, where, what, where should my child be right now if, if they're between the age of zero to five. And um, what are the possibilities? And, and what does it look like to be ready for kindergarten? Um, the, their interest as we, as we revealed information about that was very, very high. Let me hear you one more time. What color is Clifford? Red. 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 So we're learning the color red. The outcome of that red. research, the Fresno Street Saints Early Childhood Education Project. If they come to class, you know, they see all the activities and all the kids and stuff, they'll, you know, they'll learn to behave and, and how to act with other kids in class and, and that way later on in school and life they'll, they'll know how to behave and stuff. The project involves three-hour classes twice a week. The children are taught basic skills including early literacy, math, and science. But the teaching goes one step further in that the program requires parents to attend classes with their child. Whatever we do, we introduce the curriculum to the parent first so that they can in turn introduce it to the child. And their active participation is so vital to the overall learning process. Linda Ross attends the classes with her three-year-old granddaughter, Kendra. I learned the color raw, red. <laughs> so I feel that I'm gonna learn a little bit of Spanish and I'll get into that with them, and she's also going to learn that. So being in a multicultural class, we're going to learn quite a bit. The program not Where only educates the child, but the parent as well. They get a folder, they get a curriculum, they're actually actively involved in everything that's going on through the process. So we're teaching them how to be patient, how to um, just make sure that the child is learning at a very pace that's comfortable enough for the child without putting too much pressure on the child. They're only three, four, and five. And for the most part, this is their first exposure to early childhood education. Daniel Salazar says this program is giving his son opportunities he didn't have as a child. It's really important because I started in kindergarten and I wish I would have went to a head start or preschool or whatever like this because um, it was kind of hard for me. Stop down. But yeah, it's good for them. The hope is with a program like this, the children in the Bigby Villa neighborhood get a better start and enter kindergarten ready to learn. So when she gets into preschool, she won't be too far behind to where it's easy for her to pick up and understand what it is that expected of her in preschool and not just sit there and cry for mommy. Thanks, Claudia. If you would like to learn more about the Fresno Street Saints Early Childhood Education Project, call 860-0166 or go to kbpt.org and click on 0 to 5 in 30 minutes. This program funded in part by First Five Fresno County. At First Five, we focus on the first five years of life. We fund programs and services that better the lives of children in Fresno County. Additional funding from First Five Tulare County. Changing lives and building futures. Because it's all about the kids.